Kolkata is all prepped up and ready for the Mahagadbandan rally that will take place in the city tomorrow. It is really a rally where representatives of all major opposition parties will be present. Now, yesterday, Mamta Banerjee, West Bengal Chief Minister, said that it's not about who will actually lead this Gadbandan, but the regional parties will definitely be the deciding factor after elections. She also predicted BJP's fortune, saying that the BJP will not get more than 125 seats in the upcoming general elections, which are about 80 days away. Meanwhile, today, Congress President Rahul Gandhi has written a letter to West Bengal Chief Minister Mamta Banerjee extending support. And his letter to her reads, the entire opposition is united. I extend my support to Mamta Di on the show of unity and hope that we send a powerful message of a united India together. My colleague Monidipa Banerjee now joins us on the phone line from Kolkata. Monidipa, we saw those visuals of Kolkata being all prepped up. They're all different opposition leaders and their placards, which are, you know, the entire city is dotted with them. And amidst that, now comes Rahul Gandhi's show of support for this big, huge rally that is supposed to take place in, the, in Kolkata tomorrow. Well, I can tell you that the Trinamool Congress is being very restrained about it. Apparently, the email uh, came in the morning. Uh, but uh, it was not shared. Uh, the Trinamool did not speak about it. And it is from Delhi that we've heard about this particular email from Rahul Gandhi to Mamta D, you know, wishing her um, the best for her Mahatma Bandhan Jali. Uh, that's one. The second thing is that uh, the Trinamool is being restrained, as I said. Uh, and But they are absolutely, absolutely overjoyed. Because somehow, you know, yesterday when this... Uh, Satish Mishra was, uh, you know, named by Mayawati as somebody who would be attending uh, the rally. It was like the icing on the cake, and now it's the cherry on top, because virtually the entire opposition in the country, barring the left, the uh, KCR's uh, TRS party, Naveen Patnaik, and Jagan Mohan Reddy, um, and perhaps in the West, uh, there is also a little question mark over uh, you know, the Shiv Sena. Barring that, everybody who is anybody in India's political firmament and the opposition side, they are going to be here. So a huge, huge number of feathers in the cinnamon cap. Much excitement on the ground about what this is actually going to mean. You know, so I was also trying to you know, think, what is it that is going to mean? There are roughly 20 top leaders who are going to be sharing the diet. So uh, 20 top leaders, just give them 10 seats each. That is a substantial number. Now, in those 20 leaders, we haven't counted Mamta Banerjee, who has about 30, 35 seats from Bengal. And then now, if the Congress is on board, the numbers look really, really good for the opposition gathering. So no, you know, no wonder Mamta Banerjee is pleased to have engineered this huge opposition, Mahagat Bandhan. But, of course, uh, that's the arithmetic. Uh, we don't know what will happen. And we heard Ms. Gately saying a little earlier that it's chemistry that's going to work. So it's now up to the opposition to strike that chemical you know, reaction among the people to see that their side wins. Win or not, Mamta Banerjee has made it clear, it will be the regional parties who will determine who governs Delhi right. in the coming elections.